Question for you. What do your laptop and an ancient dungeon have in common? Yeah, I know. Both can lock you up in an aggravating way. But the answer I'm looking for is, they both have a lot of secret stuff and amazing tricks that you'll never find if you don't look well enough. Here are some hidden opportunities of your laptop. 1. If you sit at your workplace and receive a call or a message on your phone, you can answer either of them from your laptop. MacBooks allows you to do this. You need to have the same Apple ID on your phone and computer. The connection between Android and Windows is also possible thanks to the Your Phone app. You can't make such a connection between iPhone and Windows, but there are many well-known messengers that have mobile and desktop versions. 2. It's not necessary to buy an additional monitor if you work a lot at the computer and one desktop is not enough. Your laptop can create as many desktops as you need. On Mac OS, such a thing is called Spaces. Press Ctrl plus up arrow and you will see all opened applications on the laptop. Hover over the top of the screen and the function to create another desktop will appear. On Windows, it's called Multiple Desktops. You can add a new one by clicking the Task View button to the right of the search box on the taskbar, then the New Desktop button. 3. Animated dynamic wallpapers can be installed not only on phones, but also on laptop screens. Open Apple in the Mac OS menu, and then choose System Preferences, Desktop and Screen Saver, and Desktop Photos, then pick a dynamic desktop. There is no such built-in function in Windows, but you can download an application with similar features. 4. Set the Do Not Disturb mode on your laptop. You won't be distracted by notifications, messages, and calls. On Windows, click the cog icon in the Start menu, then choose System and Focus Assist to configure how notifications and notification rules work. The mode itself can be launched from the Action Center. Click the notification icon to the right of the taskbar to find it. On Mac OS, you can configure this mode through the System Settings in the Notification section. But the easiest way to enable this mode is to swipe two fingers from the right side to the center on the touchpad and click the Do Not Disturb switch with a crescent icon. 5. There are many ways to take a screenshot, but now Mac OS developers have added a screen recording function, recording a selected area, editing a thumbnail, and setting a timer for the screenshot. All these functions open when you press Command plus Shift plus 5. 6. You don't have to buy a cable to display the image from laptop on your TV screen. You can do this wirelessly. The main thing is that your TV should support this function. On Windows, open Action Center, then click Connect to see a list of all wireless devices you can connect to. On Mac OS, you can do this with AirPlay. In the menu bar, you will see all available Apple TVs. You can also display the image using the Chrome browser. Click Cast from the Chrome menu, choose Cast Desktop from the drop-down, and you can mirror your Mac display to any Chromecast or Chromecast-compatible screen. 7. On Windows and Mac OS, you may turn on the Typing Dictation function. On Mac, System Preferences, Keyboard, and Dictation. On Windows, Dictation is installed using Ease of Access, then Speech. Then press Win plus H whenever you want to dictate text. 8. The Mac OS developers have added a very cool feature called Smart Folders. These folders are a kind of special file filter that helps you work quickly and efficiently. Suppose you create a huge project related to astronomy. You have scattered files, documents, photos, and tables associated with a project all over the computer. The Smart Folder can help you collect all these documents in a couple of clicks in one place. Here's how to do it. In the Finder window, press the keys Command plus Option plus N. Then enter the search criteria. For example, files named stars or photographs made over a specific time period. Mac OS provides a huge number of filters. The Smart Folder collects all these files in one place. Thus, you can filter downloads, documents, photos, music, anything. 9. Spotlight Search is a very handy feature for quickly finding anything on Mac OS. But besides this, it is also a quick calculator. Open Spotlight and right in the search bar, enter the math problem that you need to solve. 
Also, Spotlight uses data from the internal dictionary. Enter any word in the search bar and get data about this word from the dictionary. But its coolest feature is conversion of any quantities. Distances, weight, speed, temperature, enter the parameter you need, and Spotlight instantly converts it to another. 10. A useful key combination if the dock on your MacBook annoys you. Press Command plus Option plus D, and the dock panel will disappear. Click again, and the panel will reappear. 11. A quick and easy way to draw the Apple logo. In any text editor, press the Option plus Shift plus K keys, and the company icon will appear. It works only on an English keyboard layout. 12. Do you often use the Win button in your Windows laptop? By itself, its only function is to open the main menu. But in combination with other keys, it is quite useful. Win plus M or D minimizes all windows and opens the desktop. If you hold down the Windows button and press plus, the screen magnifier turns on. You can zoom objects in and out. Win plus E allows you to open the Explorer quickly. By pressing Win plus R, the Run window opens, where you can open any program, file, folder, or web page. Win plus L allows you to lock the desktop quickly, useful only if you have an account password. And this is only a small part of the key's functions. 13. On Mac OS, such a unique key is Command, and here are some cool combinations with it. Command plus up or down. Instantly scroll up and down any web page. Command plus 1, 2, or 3. Use these keys to conveniently switch between any open tabs in your browser. Command plus 1 will take you to the first tab. Command plus 2 will take you to the second, etc. Command plus H. Quickly hide all open windows from the currently active app. Command plus Shift plus T. Instantly open the last closed tab in your browser. 14. This is not a useful feature, but a funny Easter egg, which few people know about. Open WinRare, go to the Help About WinRare, and click on the logo. Check it. It can be that the logo books begin to fall down and then bounce back, or you can see the ocean surf and waves move. Which one did you see? Share in the comments. 15. Skype has a huge number of hidden emoticons. For example, if you write Toivo in brackets, you'll see a man with a dog. Write Rock and it shows you. Type Pool Party and you'll see a dancing person who is certainly ready for fun. 16. If there are any secret folders or files on your Mac that no one should find, then you can hide them. Go to System Preferences Security and Privacy pane and turn on File Vault. This will encrypt your entire hard drive, so someone would need your password to get at its contents. 17. The fastest way to block access to your MacBook is to press Command plus Control plus Q. 18. If you have a Windows computer, then you probably like playing games. Windows 10 Creators Update has a special game mode thanks to which you can increase the FPS level and improve game performance. Follow these steps to use Windows 10 Game Mode. In the Settings, click on Gaming. Then select Game Mode from the left-hand menu. You should now see the Game Mode page and a switch called Game Mode, which should be on by default. If it is not, turn it on yourself. The Game Mode is now enabled globally, which means that Windows 10 uses it for all the games you play on your PC. Reviews about the Game Mode are ambiguous. Some tests suggest that it can add a few FPSs, while others state the effect is not noticeable or even opposite to what was expected. Still, worth a try. Um, if your computer starts to smoke, don't blame me. And tell your computer to knock it off. Smoking is a bad habit to start. Hey, if you learned something new today, then give the video a like and share it with a friend. And here are some other cool videos I think you'll enjoy. Just click to the left or right, and remember, stay on the bright side of life.